The third day of the Canada trip is an unexpected one as we make the two plus hour trek into Kicking Horse Mountain Resort. The mountain itself is an expert's paradise and still has tons of great lines even in low snow years. Today we explore what the mountain had open and we were pleasantly surprised. The views to complement the steep were astonishing and we had a banger day on the slopes. Enjoy episode 6 of season 5. coming at you from Kicking Horse Mountain. We drove two hours from the town of Banff to Kicking Horse to ski. This is our first new resort in Canada in a couple of years. So it has a lot of challenging terrain, none of it which is open because of the coverage, the low coverage this time of season. Uh, it's a funky mountain. It's like Crystal Mountain, but more condensed. It's got a gondola that goes from base to top, just like Crystal Mountain. And they have one other lift, Upper Mountain, that we're probably gonna try and loop just this gondola and the stairway to heaven is what it's called. Uh, to find some sort of train they have. I think we're gonna be skiing above this mist or cloud layer because right now it's cloudy but we went down through the fog as you saw early in the drive so hopefully we'll break out in the sun here and our mid lenses uh, can actually do some work instead of just having to go stormy so yeah great day coming up let's get to it.
we've done one run. That's how it is at Kicking Horses. One run and back to the bottom. That one was pretty freaking good though. Uh, steep at the top and a nice long bomber at the bottom. And rip the stairway to heaven for the rest of the day probably. There's a lot of good train over there, and the rest is just bladed train, which we can get at home. So, yeah, let's get back on the ground. How you gonna do it by yourself? Cause I'm not gonna be here to help you. I should have, but my legs left me. Yeah. That was good. That yeah, was, that was pretty sweet. I didn't see that very well, but... i 
kicking horse and that was one hell of a day I say that a lot but this one was definitely amazing uh, for December they have the most terrain open I've seen from Banff the terrain itself was very good they have a lot of good steep terrain some of the shoots reminded me a little bit of the Cirque from Snowbird the snow was very good very chalky in some places uh, and chunky too I, I had a wipeout which I'll show in the bonus clips it's a little bit of flat light here and there but this is like the first or second time skiing through the clouds. I think we skied through the clouds yesterday in, in Lake Louise, uh, or that could have been mist or something. But today we're definitely skiing the clouds, and you can kind of see behind me, uh, it's still a little misty. So either sunshine or Lake Louise is what we have left going on. And then squaws coming. Again, they have got everything open. Trip's still going here. As always, my name is Colonel Kicking Horse. Here with the... <laughs> Not the rock field. Oh, ow, man, that's some thick stuff. And the, I found some falls deep powder. Sorry, I was late. <laughs> nice stop, that was stylish. Huh? Nice stop, that was stylish. Thank you. There's ice in my nose. There's ice in my butt. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh. <laughs>